welcome to my presentation this is k divya from second bsc bjc from dk government college nellore a special thanks to our mentor t sri ranjini ma'am for this opportunity today my topic is about our dna technology recombinant dna technology is the process of joining of dna molecules of two different species, species to form a new hybrid dna it was discovered by herbert boyer and stanley cohen in the year of 1973 now let us go the steps in our dna technology number 1 isolation of desired genetic material in this step we isolate the desired dna in its pure form that is from other macromolecules like proteins lipids by using enzymes like proteases number 2 restriction enzyme digestion we use restriction enzyme as a molecular scissor to cut dna at specific locations number 3 amplification using pcr the cut dna fragments can be amplified by using pcr and number 4 ligation of dna molecules to form our dna the process of joining of dna molecule of desired gene and the vector by using the enzyme dna ligase is called ligation this results in the formation of recombinant dna number 5 insertion of recombinant dna into host in this step the recombinant dna is introduced into a recipient host cell mostly a bacterial cell this process is called transformation and finally the isolation of recombinant cells under their expression of desired product for isolation of recombinant cell from non recombinant cell a marker gene of plasmid vector is employed for example pbr322 plasmid vector and the expression of desired product will be done by culturing transformed host organism finally we get our desired product now the applications of our dna technology it is used to detect hiv presence in a person it is also used in gene therapy in clinical diagnosis and it is also used to produce genetically modified organisms in agriculture it is also used for the production of insulin thank you so much